Excellent! Hello everyone and welcome back once again to Paul's Hardware. Today I'm going to be doing a quick unboxing and overview of this uh, open air test bed. I found myself recently being really fond of open air test beds since I do a lot of work with different computer parts and configurations at work. They're incredibly useful because it makes it really easy to swap parts in and out. And I've been considering purchasing one for use here in, in this room where I shoot videos. And um, I was looking at an HSPC, the, uh, the tech station that they make, which is awesome and fantastic. Um, it's a little on the pricey side when you consider that there's there can be like 130 250 bucks for the nicer ones. Uh, but then I found this one. This is the T60, specifically the T60B from Lian Lee. Um, here it's called the Pits, Pit Stop T60. That's an ATX, a micro ATX test bench. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and take it all out of the box, get it all assembled, and then I'll kind of come back and give you guys some, uh, some of my thoughts on this particular little test bed. So there it is, and there you have it, uh, my new test bed, which is currently outfitted with the Z87 motherboard, where I'm doing a bit of a uh, bit of motherboard testing, a bit of CPU testing, perhaps. Uh, that's for a different video. Uh, as far as this test bed goes, I know these are just my initial thoughts since I just got it assembled. I'm sorry I didn't show you the uh, system installation. I had meant to record that, and I don't think it recorded properly. Uh, but the test bed itself has been doing fantastic. It's uh, so much sturdier being metal than uh, a lot of like the acrylic and plastic test beds that I've seen before. So um, you do get what you pay for a little bit with that. Uh, the price right now is, I don't know, it's it's it seems good when you compare it to like an HSPC. But at the same time, looking at the metal that's in, in there, and it, you know, since it come flat, comes flat packed, it doesn't seem, I don't know, It's I'm on the fence about it. But personally, since I do have use of this, uh, I've been pretty impressed with it so far. A couple quirks about it. The Lian Lee logo was on upside down when I first got it. Um, I used a heat, uh, a hair heat gun. I used a, a hair dryer and kind of loosened the adhesive and pulled it off. And it's got a couple little plugs at the back of it. So you just fl flipped it and put it back on. Um, so it stayed centered and everything. 
Uh, and then apart from that, uh, Leon Lee does sell some accessories for this one. That's my my probably my biggest issue is that um, you get front panel uh, at at the front of it here, right? You get a power and reset button, uh, but you don't get this front panel, so you don't get your USB or your front panel audio, which isn't a huge deal for an open test bed. Uh, they also sell a, uh, t a 240 millimeter radiator holder, like a bracket that you can install right here. As you can probably tell, I've done a, a quick installation of a radiator. Uh, this is a Thermal Take Water 2.0 Extreme. I used some uh, some zip ties up here at the top and some corks to kind of give it a little bit of support right there. And I, it's actually been working great. It's pushing air straight across the rest of the components on the board. But yeah, uh, I guess that's it for my uh, my quick unboxing, a quick assembly, a uh, quick little overview of this uh, little test bed. Uh, once again, this has been the Pit Stop T60, specifically the T60B. It's all, uh, this is black version. Also available in silver and red, I believe, if you can find those colors available. Uh, I got this off a of Newegg, where I think it was 90 bucks at the time, which seemed seemed somewhat reasonable to me, again, if you really need a test bed. And then the, the other uh, thing is that from the pictures, you can't really see this little prop stand thing here at the back. I was kind of disappointed when I saw that because it seems like separate from this whole unit which has the handle and everything but um, after making use of it it's definitely good that it's there it keeps it much more balanced and um, if you do need better access like uh, you can remove it easily with the thumb screws to get like at these screws for the power supply and whatnot but uh, that's 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 it I guess uh, that's my first impressions of the pit stop t60 from Leon Lee uh, open air test bed I'm sure you guys will be seeing this in future videos but thanks for watching this one. Uh, check it out on Newegg. I'll put a link in the description. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget the like button, which is right down there. Uh, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss my future videos when I post them. And we'll see you all in the next video.